We could do the advanced reaction for the pistol right now. Dude, it actually cocked it too. <gasps> oh my god, it wants to kill me. The zombie tried to kill me. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Lab of the Dead. I'm your host, the Borgman Otis Falcon. The first video went up, and honestly, I really enjoyed it, and the majority of you seem to enjoy it as well. So I figure we give another video here if you guys do enjoy this one. We'll probably do the entire thing going forward. A lot of people also mentioned that apparently Road of the Dead is a continuation of this series, so if I do like this going forward and we do complete this run, we'll probably give Road of the Dead a try down the line as well. Uh, for now though, I took some time off camera to research speed upgrades, so that way we research things a lot faster. And we're doing less waiting and more experimenting going down the line. So for today we have to, let's see. Um, as a matter of fact, we're almost done with this day already, it seems. Use items of the specimen, discover 22, one more reaction, and we have to research the tapes. Two of the alpha ones over here, so how about we do the tapes first? And let's, let's, look how fast it's going now. I took some time to just farm points for research speed, and that's going to make it a lot easier for us to progress through the story. To develop a viable cure, I need to account for the mutations that occur when the virus is transferred to a new host. I also need to have a switch mechanism at the molecular level to prevent the virus's behavior change once the host is deceased. Okay. But if we look at this closer, go to basic reactions, let's see. We have seen neutral, we haven't seen passive. If we want to get the passive reaction for that, we have to do... Humanity 4, which is really good already. 64% mood or higher. So technically speaking, I think this one right here should be the passive one. Yeah, there it is. So this is going to be new. Okay, so first she tried to bite it. She's still biting it, but she seems a bit more... complacent about it. There was like kind of like a weird look in her eyes. It was kind of like, oh... Maybe a small hint of humanity in the zombie still. And even the music changed and everything as well. How about that? And the other one's gonna be aggressive. For that one, we have to piss you off, so I probably have to beat you down for a while. For that one, we have to get mood 36 or less. And... or hunger 54. Oh, so if we kind of get you hungry, you could probably do the aggressive. I think we have to do both of them. 36 and hunger at 54. So after we make you hungry, get your mood down, and you'll give us the aggressive reaction for the rubber duck. Okay. So I let's see the research here for now. What have we got here? Damn the smell. How do they expect me to cook food with that foul smell around? Isn't there someone in charge of cleaning the place? They could at least put something in the air. Some anti-order thingy. I don't know. Every time I try to add seasoning, I naturally go by smell. But it's way off because of that goddamn zombie smell that gets mixed in. <laughs> okay, we have to do one more note as well. And we'll be done with this day here today. So let's do that note now. And we have 650. Let's start pissing you off a bit if I can. So, I also unlocked the knife. I guess we could give that a try. So what if I stab you over here? Or slash you? Okay, that's gonna probably make you really angry. Mood? Negative three this time around. So I think we probably want to do that quite a bit. To get her mood down. And then if her hunger goes up, we could do the next, um... Little, um... Duck thing. So that's dropping by 3% every single time. Let's see. You're at 56 at the moment. Still need a little bit more hunger, though. So I need to figure out what makes you hungry again. I forgot what makes you hungry. What if I toss the beach ball, the beach ball at you? What does that do for us? The beach ball is going to be... Okay, it makes you hungry. Apparently tossing the beach ball makes you hungry. So if we toss that a couple of times, I think that should be enough. 54 hunger. So all we really have to do now is just piss you off. Let's just kind of beat you down a bit more. How much does that give us? Mood minus three. What if I shoot you? Three. Okay. So we're getting there. Right arm. And we have a lot of extra points, so we should probably research something while we're at it. My research is ready. Hmm. What's this? So we have the S14 specifications. Project Flatline, leader Dr. Lori, which is the lady we've been hearing the reports from. Infection symptoms. Full infection from the S14 virus can take as long as three days and as little as 20 minutes, depending on the rate of blood contamination. 
Once the virus gets in the bloodstream, the symptoms will include fever, sharp muscle pain, loss of sensitivity, blurry vision, heat waves, paralysis, and more. The virus is 100% lethal, so any attempt to stop or slow down the infection is useless. Dang. We've been here for a week already. The morale is low, and listening to that damn radio makes it even worse. I don't think the military will last more than a couple days against such an unconventional enemy. They're expecting zombies to drop dead as if they were fighting Germans or Vietnamese people. Although some of them are probably German or Vietnamese, they're already dead, and not inclined to drop so easily. Nationality's never been so irrelevant. <laughs> okay, it's important that I research speed technique to make my research even go faster. Well, I've actually done that already, so we're going really fast as it is. New research options. Talking to the group, I've come up with some more things I like to try with the specimens. Toy gun, a live rat this time, toy plane, and a Barbie. I need to reduce my research costs and I think I can optimize my lab to help me do that. I've added research cost techniques to my research folder. So if we go over to, let's see, this will be new items for us to check out. Techniques, we want to go with research costs. Lower that a bit. That'll be done pretty fast, and let's see. Let's continue beating you down so we get that other event this way. What if I slash your head? And I think the last one we have to do is probably that arm. Yeah. Oh, by the way, we can see the slash from the, um, the knife now, too, on the body. That's really cool. All right, let's go over to objects now and try out the duck. Now that's aggressive. Oh, you see that? Now it's biting and, like, even thrashing around. And I think we should be able to get some aggressive ones from everything else. So the stick one, we've seen default and we've seen passive. We can now do aggressive stick as well. Hmm, okay. You kind of swung it around like a weapon to begin with. Now, what's the last one? Hold up. Advanced reaction. Mood 79 or more. Humanity 24 or more. So humanity's there, now we just have to make you really happy for the advanced reaction for the duck. What about for the stick? 25 or less. So we could do the advanced one for stick, all we have to do is piss you off a bit more. What about pistol? This is unloaded, by the way. So we could now do... Pistol unloaded. Did you see that? It tried to, it tried to shoot. It tried to shoot the gun that was unloaded, so if we give it the unloaded one... Could it shoot me? <laughs> oh, I'm worried about this one. Please don't kill me. Please don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Oh my god, it's shooting the gun now. Thankfully, it wasn't towards me. That's good. But I wonder if the advanced reaction could be towards me. No, that has to be 77 or more mood. Okay, so we kind of have to make you happy now, huh? Okay. We have a thousand, by the way, so we should probably research something because we have a bunch of points here just saved up. Um, let's start getting the banana unlock. Sure, why not? And let's see. What about the book? For the book, we've seen passive and neutral. This would be the aggressive book reaction. Oh, now you're trying to eat the book, too. Oh, my God. You're just really, really angry now. I don't blame you. I've been slashing you quite a while. And the advanced reaction here is 65 or more, so we have to make you happy for most of those, but the stick has to be mood 25, so we gotta beat you down a bit more. 25 or less, perfect. Humanity 22 or more, perfect. Oop, wrong one. Stick. This is the advanced reaction for the stick now. Sorry, <gasps> you can't leave. It wants to escape! It totally wants to escape. It's lear it's adapting. Oh my god. Well, luckily that's a wooden stick, so that's gonna get you through. But any other thing stronger than that could be a problem. I'm done with my re. I can put this item to great use. And we can do the banana one more time. Go for it. We got extra points for it. Okay. So let's see here. We got everything done. All we have to do now is just research the tapes and the uh, notes. My research is. I believe I now know how to use this item to its full extent. And now the banana has been completely researched as well. Let's go over here and. <sighs> Let's unlock the Barbie. And let's go over to objects. Where's the banana? Oh, it's gonna be at food, right? Aggressive banana. <laughs> yep, you probably don't want that. Um, have we done aggressive rat? No. Aggressive dead rat. Are you gonna bite it this time? 
It's still refusing to bite a dead rat, oddly enough, even though it's pissed off. But I'm pretty sure that it's pissed off and we do the live run. It'll probably bite into I've it this time. My this item will help me get more reactions. Let me get some more Barbie research here. Okay. And let's try the Barbie out one. Neutral. Oh, yeah, you're trying to... Yeah, exactly. Brains, tasty brains. This is doll, though. Intriguing. So for the Barbie... Oh, we still have to get the research. Hold on. My research is... Comp I can put this item to great use. One more Barbie research. Let's see. Go back to objects here. So, we've seen neutral. For aggressive, we're looking for 28 or less, which we got. She has to be hungrier for the aggressive one, though. So we have to make you a bit hungry, which I think we get that by... Oh, yeah, the beach ball, we said, right. Passive would be 72 or more. Right now, I want to get all the aggressive things, so then we can just build back up to passive and neutral afterwards. And meanwhile, let's toss that ball at you. Oh, aggressive. Oh, my God. Dude, it wasn't having any of that ball here today. Don't hit me with the beach ball. <laughs> so we got all the beach ball reactions now. Let's try the baseball out. Is it going to be weapons now? Yeah, okay. Aggressive base. Oh my god, just caught it in the mouth. And that one makes you hungry as well. My research is great. That'll be useful to trigger new reactions. Here it is. So, food, live rat, aggressive. Oh my god. Oh, I just popped his head. Kill one animal with your research. Yeah, we did that. We have aggressive apples as well. Will that make you hungry? You used to like apples. Hunger plus. No, we're looking for minus that. So I'm not yet. With my I can put this item to great use. Do the rad one again. 24 humanity. Oh, we could do we could do the advanced reaction for the pistol right now. Dude, it actually cocked it too. <gasps> oh my god, it wants to kill me. The zombie tried to kill me. So let me guess, if we give her the loaded pistol and advanced reaction, it's going to literally kill me, isn't it? Okay, so I think we learned never to give it the loaded pistol now. <laughs> I'm going to hold off on that Research one. Is, I believe I now know Holy how to crap. To its full extent. Alrighty, let's get these research saves unlocked now, because everything else I think we've just about done here for now. <laughs> We've got more infected in the storage room now. I don't even want to know how or where Walker gets them. My tests indicate that their aggressiveness can be brought down significantly by constant positive reinforcement. On the other hand, aggression has a direct causation to the specimen's aggressiveness. It shows that they're still able to be conditioned to a certain point. Yeah, and we've seen that. We treat it well, it gets happier if we actually beat it down as being any more and more aggressive. Cool. Do some more tapes. Hi, this is Private Peter Johnson. This is my <laughs> second... Mr. Johnson, you don't need to present yourself or count your logs. I archive the logs every time with all the required information. Sorry, Doctor. And call me Pete. Mr. Johnson is fine. Proceed. Sorry. Um, I've been guarding the storage room for a few days now. They totally give me the creeps. I stare at them and they stare back. They're trying to grab me. Good thing they're behind bars. Nothing else to report so far. Mm-hmm. Okay. This specimen has surpassed my projections for aggressiveness. What reactions can I get from it in this extreme state? Ooh, it's fully aggressive now. I'm done with my research. Let's see. In order to trigger all possible reactions, it's important to know what you're working with. Doing research on items and by pressing holding them. Yeah, yeah. So I know that one already. The last node. I think we're technically done. I'm going to let this kind of search itself, or at least finish off, and then we'll wrap up the day here. That thing wants to kill me. It absolutely wants to kill me now. My research is... This is interesting. To be distributed to the entire research staff, hygiene protocols must be applied to their full extent. Due to the, various, the very dangerous nature of the S14 virus, full isolation gear must be used by any contact with a specimen must be followed by a complete decontamination to ensure that there are no traces of S14 outside the laboratory. 
every instrument must be sterilized after each operation and all the clothes washed, no exception. Day 9. The tapes and notes from the Alpha team are not very helpful so far. It seems like they were working on a cure, but without their actual data or equipment, I can't do anything. And why would they waste time on any psychological test when they had everything necessary to work directly with the genetic material? Every item except weapons has an advanced reaction. Before you can trigger it, you need to trigger all three basic reactions and fully research the item. You can research, yeah. That's what we've been doing, technically. I need to extend my research options. I think these items will help me greatly. Rifle, insects, and a music player. Oh, the music player from, um, Dawn of the Dead. Homeboy loved his Zom Walkman. So, let's see here. Where, there it is, music player. We gotta get that one. We have to get that one. And for this one, we're looking for two notes from the team, one tape, and then use 12 items on the specimen. We already have enough reactions for the day already. I've completed my... This item will help me get more reactions. All right, let's try it out. So, objects. You're gonna be in an aggressive mood probably for this one. Yeah. Angry zombie listens to music. No, don't like it. Get it out of here. She must be listening to modern music. Ayo! Ayo! Yeah, I know, Grandpa, you don't like music from the past, do you? Okay, so let's just research that a bit more. I'm done with my. I believe I now know how to use this item to its full extent. Good. You know what? Let's see if we can get some more techniques here. I need to, like. Is there something for the hunger? We could control humanity and mood, but no hunger just yet, which would be very, very useful. But let's do. Mood control, I guess. Get that upped a little bit. And what have we not used right now? That's just gonna, that's gonna take away our hunger, though. I know it is. What's well, a new reaction anyway? Yeah, I think we. Oh, the hunger went down. Oh. Oh, so wait, wait, wait. Give you stuff you like. Oh my God! You even ate the stick this time. Okay, hold up. I think we got it then. Hunger minus 0 0.3. Perfect. Dead rad. We've seen that one before, and that one's gonna also... Oh, that's gonna be plus two. So we give him kebab and chunk of mead, and the, re the hunger will reduce. And we're looking for 44 hunger, we said, right? This is the perfect way to do it. It's gonna take me a while. But you know what? I'll just do this off camera. I'll just farm it over and over until the hunger goes down. Although I'm going through my resources, so let's keep that in mind. But that seems to be the best way to reduce the hunger this far. And we're down to 53. Yeah, it's gonna take a while. You know what? I'm gonna reduce it off camera though, so we don't have to grind it here on the video. My research is perfect. I will work more efficiently this way. Now we have bonus for the moves too. Excellent. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna wrap it up here for this one. I will do some grinding off camera. And this way it's not so repetitive for us. We basically just get the reaction to the story. And I'll get the proper moods. We'll come back next video. If you wanna see some more anyway. And I'll have the proper hunger, and we'll do all of the advanced reactions for aggressive low hunger and then we'll increase the happiness which is very easy and we'll do all the other advanced reactions going forward as I, as I mentioned if you guys want to see some more do let me know and i'll do the entire thing and if this goes well we could do road of the dead down the line as well hopefully you guys enjoyed it i will catch you next time